Hello YouTube, what's up guys? Welcome to another fragrance review. Today we are going to talk about Valentino Uomo. First of all, I want to start this video by saying that this is not a your own copycat. I will be honest, when I first smelled this fragrance, I thought it definitely does share quite a bit of similarities with your own, but as soon as I took another, enough of time to test this one out, to really get to know this fragrance, I realized they are two different scents and they are not too similar as some people claim it to be. So without making this too long, let's start with a review of your of Valentino Uomo. This fragrance was released in 2014 and the notes listed are bergamot, myrtle, coffee, chocolate, hazelnut, leather and cedarwood. When you first spray, the, spray this fragrance on, it opens with the, this wonderful herbal, slightly aromatic note that it's coming from myrtle and you get just a tiny bit of bergamot but very soon uh, the fragrance starts to develop into a gourmand, a full-blooded gourmand. You get that delicious notes of coffee, of hazelnut, of chocolate and when it completely dries down you get some leather and some cedar wood. Fragrance is sweet, delicious, warm, spicy, kind of inviting and it's just so well done. There's nothing that pops out too much in this fragrance. It's all rounded so nicely and it is just delicious. Uh, I would say this is a very good uh, fragrance when it comes to performance. You get 8 to 10 hours. Now projection wise it's never too much. It's never uh, a projection beast but it will get the job done. You know it is that kind of a fragrance that somehow invites you in. It makes a person standing close to you want to come even closer to be able to smell you because there is something just so alluring and inviting about this fragrance. Valentina Uomo is sexy, it is seductive, it is inviting, it is warm and it is so easy to like and so easy to wear. I think it is a perfect cold weather uh, date night scent although it can easily be pulled off in everyday situations, casual situations. It's quite versatile but I would definitely say it works best in cold weather because that, then it is when it really shines and it cuts through chilly and cold air and pops off of your skin. If you still haven't tried Valentino Uomo, give this one a try uh, without worrying too much about your own similarities. They are, in my opinion, after all, two quite different scents. Thank you guys for watching. Please comment down below, rate, subscribe and see you soon with another review. Bye!